Alright, so last time, I approved the power of sign. And with that, retired him. Forever. <laughs> Dude's old. Maybe not you forever. You have to use Cyan again. Do you? Maybe In not. order to get one of the best things in the game, you do. Eh. I don't know Details. about retired forever, but for now, he is in fact resting his old bones. Entertaining yes, his new child. Good. You're already heading to the best place ever. And Am I? It might not be the best place ever, but it's decent. Calling in. Oh, well, that's not actually the place I was talking about, but that's fine. Oh, good. It's lock story time. Yeah, we're here. Hello, Shadow. So if you only had a party of three, you could recruit him here. But he costs money, so forget that. Uh, when can I permanently recruit him? Not for a while. <laughs> hmm. A moment. I'm going to check something out real fast. No, we're, we are there. Excuse me, Shadow. Can we only take Interceptor? We don't need you. Yeah, only Interceptor. Hmm. I want your dog. Okay, we're good. Getting a little, like, audio warble over uh, Discord, and I don't actually know oh. what's causing that. Okay. Were you hearing that? Are either of you hearing that? Too? I can hear it a little bit, yes. All right. I don't think it's bad, though. I say keep going. Yeah, 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 it's fine. I just wanted to know if it was on my end or if that was Discord in general. Iron, silk, armor. Yeah, nothing good. Nothing new here. Nothing new yet. It's the next place. The twist headband actually is new. Is it? No, no sorry. I'm thinking of five again. I wouldn't worry about buying it, though. It's really expensive for the minor uh, boost it gives, so don't worry about that. <laughs> oh, no. Tara, you destroyed yeah. this man's home. Before you go to the big house on the top right, you should go to the smaller house on the bottom and the top left. All right. Okay, there is a house there. It makes a lot more sense this way. Something about a man doing herbs. Also, these two twins again. Ah, uh, I recognize the name Rachel. But yeah, you can actually walk in the back of his house, the big house in the top right, uh, and there's a uh, chest in there. The main reason I told you to come to the house in the top left is not because of this story. The story's dumb. It's there's the clock there, you can get an elixir. <laughs> The story is dumb. It makes you not really like Locke as much. Locke, Master Treasure Hunter, defeated by a bridge.
Huh. <laughs> I... I honestly thought there was more to the whole Rachel thing other than Locke's an idiot. No, that's, that's about right. So... The SNES version, when Locke gets kicked out of the house and he says, wait, let me talk to her, he says, she said yes. She said she was gonna, and implying that she he had proposed to her. Oh. So it's even worse. There's the real shit. There's the good shit right there. Oh, I missed the door. I was like, oh, is there another cutscene? Then <laughs> it immediately kicked me. In. Oh, <laughs> I didn't quite go through the door there. All right. Now and go to the house in the top right. They're hooting and hollering about herbs. Yep. Yeah. This is where you go to the top house. What's in the basement? I hate this. Go back there. I hate this. What? This is wrong on multiple levels. I hate this. I think it was implied she didn't actually die. She just was knocked into a very, like, almost dead state, and this guy saved her. Okay. Um, saved, quote-unquote. Except for the fact that they might have changed something in the tr this translation, because it's not that at all in this translation. Yeah. In this, they're very much implying that she died. Yeah. And they're just preserving the body, which makes it... No... Now I hate Locke. <laughs> no, he's just keeping her body fresh so he can resurrect her. Or something. I don't know. I'm gone. He, if he was like a mad scientist. So, uh, go north of town, by the way, up by the little crescent thing. Uh, once you get outside and see the map, there's a uh, thing there. Also, there's a chest in the uh, back of the house in the top right that you had to mm -hmm. walk around the back for. Thank you, DT, for the reminder on that one. I guess we're going back then. Yeah, you can swing by on your way. And that's the flash. It, it does yep. damage. It's a big flash bulb. He's taking a picture. Mm -hmm. It's one of those old-timey cameras that give off radiation. I guess someone is referencing the Queen song. I mean, who wouldn't? I was thinking it. Alright, back in the house. Walk around the house? Yes, you have to go around to the bridge area. You know in Legend of Zelda when you have to go into the back of the cafe? Same thing. Oh, okay. I, I saw that and I was like, I guess I can't get over there since I didn't see the path. Alright. It's just a green beret. Hey, every little bit counts. Alright, I guess it is better armor. And it also gives you an extra one-eighth of your max HP. Mm -hmm. I guess. Numbers weren't big enough. 
doesn't really do it for me. Gave an evasion boost. That by oh itself my God. makes it useful. What's up? Done with this random encounter. Just run. <laughs> the run. same random encounter three mm -hmm. times. This one, except there's two birds. Welcome to two birds. Double birds. The game is literally flipping you off. You should show off the drill when you get a chance, by the way. Oh, save it for like a boss, man. Yeah, I guess so. Or just any big, tough enemy you're fighting by themselves. That's true. Uh, ba, 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 da, ba. What is up here anyway? I get into the part of the game where my memory is like way sketchier. It's a tiny house. Very small house with a very goofy music. I'm leaving. You should check the pots. <laughs> I was just curious if I could actually do that. Alright, I see. He has good relics. <laughs> so, earrings give a 25% magic boost. This gives a 25% magic and 25% physical boost. Can't it's sleep really in your good. bed, old man. Yeah. What's weird about your bed? He uh, doesn't want strangers sleeping in his bed? That's not weird. What's weird are the people who let you sleep in their bed. Uh, it gives you the boost, but it doesn't show it like the other ones do. The earring doesn't show it either. Oh. It's only in battle that it kicks in. So mm -hmm. it casts faith and boost on you, okay, I see. Pretty much, yeah. Alright, I'm gonna assume my next location is to the south? Yes. Mm -hmm. All the way down by that uh, little peninsula. You gotta walk ahead of you. Yep. Dogs! That's a noise! Yeah, you can totally just run from all these fights, by the way. I can try me! This. Hey! How can you get Gal? Mm -hmm. Goodbye. I love the drill. He's like, I have to wear a helmet. Safety first. Mm -hmm. As I'm drilling into living tissue. Yep, the drill is uh, Edgar's second strongest uh, single target attack relic. But it's the most consistent one, which makes it really powerful. Mm -hmm. But you can get my favorite one later. In about 20 minutes. Yeah. Not because it's better, because it's not. Because it's awesome. Yeah. Maybe walk around this whole fucking mountain, aren't they? Yep. Yep. That's why you can't get to that place right now. You have to go all the way down to the one bound by the... Peninsula. Yeah, Peninsula. I kept wanting to say Isthmus, but I didn't think that was right. No. I think that I should be fighting these to get them in the, uh, developed decks. Yeah, keep fighting these things in order to get them in develop. Yep, only have to do it once, though. So if you see that group of the two green plant monsters and the three other guys fight them once, and then that's all you have to do. Hey, look, it's Iron Fist. And his friend, Iron Fist. I see the immortal Iron Fist. You're the stupidest Iron Fist ever. Yeah, Edgar's kind of broken at the beginning of the game. And later on in the game. Just, he's broken. Jador. It doesn't hurt that you gave him the, you know, Hermes sandals. Mm hmm. Mm, hello, Mithril Vest. Hello, Ninja Gear. Yeah, a lot of the, uh, how should we say, town names in this game are pretty stupid. 
Is the white dress worth it at all? Yes. And I'm just gonna guess the mithril vest one. is also yeah, worth one. it. I would actually suggest you just get one white dress and two ninja gears and call it a day, because you can give the ninja gear or the mithril vest that uh, Locke has to Edgar. All right. Two ninja? One. Yes, one. Sorry, one. Okay. I got ahead of myself. I forgot that you already had one. I stole it. Mm -hmm. Mm hmm. From a ninja. <laughs> Not a very good ninja if I stole his vest. I wouldn't worry about it. You know, Locke is kind of relentless. He'll steal stuff from you by literally ripping the clothes off of you. Mm -hmm. As demonstrated earlier. Oh, yeah. Can I enter the back of this place? He's not no. just a pickpocket. He, Sometimes there's just chests there. He picks your entire pocket away. He's a brigand. Yeah. So you might see a weapon shop. Don't worry about buying anything there. Don't you have to buy one thing and then go to jail? Before you go on the fire ship? Yes, that is correct. Mm. But we already did that in the other place. Mm. All right. So, that guy right there. That guy right there gives you a huge hint to something that uh, Kam and I aren't going to make you even bother with him. He said, don't trust anything that those guys say in Zozo. Better gloves. Don't worry about getting it for uh, Sabin. You're going to get a better set of gloves in the next dungeon. Okay, better that katana, was about... Though. I was about... Yeah, there is a new katana. <laughs> Maybe. If by chance you start using Cyan, you will be coming back this way, so I would... We can it. bring Cyan a souvenir from the trip he was not allowed to come on. That's true. You could do that. Is this we'll a equip it to him and leave him there. No, newbie got about halfway through this game once, so he's played a little bit of it. However, I'm sure that between the two of us, Kam and I have played this game like a million times. Yeah, we've played a bunch of times. Newbie has not finished this game. He has gotten to the second. Oh, half. fuck the auction. Fuck the auction house. Auction isn't open yet. Don't worry about it. I hate the auction house so much. I it's remember, I, I remember enough TV. to remember the auction house and my rage and dislike mm -hmm. of it. <laughs> I like the music, though. Yep. Because there, 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 there's a thing there. Two things. Two things? Two? Yep. Two. Yep. <sighs> The sad that thing would is, maybe they're be both an off really, one. yes, that would definitely be an off screen thing. You show it how it works once and then say, we're not showing this again because this could take an hour. You should take, you should definitely get a chocobo if you're heading to Zozo. Mm -hmm. Avoid those random encounters. Large Child's perhaps getting a painting commissioned. Mm hmm. Nah, we're not worry about that. <laughs> It appears to be a lamp. <laughs> That's a cool thing about this game, because you go through all these places and you see a bunch of stuff that really oh, yeah. doesn't have a story implication until much later. Yeah. We haven't met a painter yet. Obviously, this is not going to be an issue. Yeah. Man, please move. In fact, you will never have a straight painter in the group. Because she has a special title that's different. Child. Yes, exactly. You got it in one. Did you just get <laughs> trapped in a corner? No. <laughs> I wanted to be there. I wanted to be there. It was my penance. I walked um, in the auction house for 10 seconds. Yeah, let's mode 7 a bit. Oh, Just that's right. Good. You did not like this the last time you did it. No, the... This is bad. The draw <laughs> distance sucks. Oh yeah, it's so much worse on the Game Boy Advance. It is, it really is. Honk. Honk. Use the minimap. Drunk Come on, you can do this. That's hey, the wrong direction. Follow. Use the mini map. Oh, 
Are you <laughs> drunk? I'm drifting. <laughs> Thank you for the follow. Yeah, thanks for the follow. Perfect timing. <laughs> and made it. Oh, right. That's not the dismount button. That's the move forward button. For some reason, there's two ways to move forward. <laughs> yeah, newbie, give me your keys. Newbie's not drunk. The chocobo is drunk. Super drunk. Yeah, those rich people got the chocobo drunk and said, yeah, let's give it to these outsiders. They don't know what they're getting into. So what type of alcohol does uh, chocobo drink? Guess shale. Okay. I would say emoonshine. Emoonshine. I like Gashel more. Yeah, I believe that somebody in Final Fantasy would learn how to make beer from Geshel Greens. People mm -hmm. make beer for, from everything. Ah, the Hill Gigas. Hello. There's your there's your target. Well, we've already yeah, drilled. That's actually a good point. Uh, after you get out of this fight, um, give uh, Celis back a sword. Okay. You can just do that here. Oh, that's an interface. <laughs> yeah, that guy's wearing a diaper. Do your job. Oh no, these this, this guy isn't the one that uses. What magic. the? What? Did you get hit by something bad? Okay, you get it back. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I forgot. I forgot they did that. You steal from me, I steal from you. Sir, are you okay? So, that, I'll, I'll remind you as, um, they said, uh, in Jador, everyone in here, save for one person, lies to you. No, they say everyone lies to you. There is one person who does There's not. There's one person in the town. He's actually to the north. And you need to head north anyway. There's one person in town who does not lie. He is also useful later. Very much. People to the north tell the truth. And people to the south lie. Yeah. And people to the north also lie. So these guys also don't cast magic at you. There's only one enemy in here who casts magic. And they look like... Um, well, you'll know when you see Silhoi Wizard. Got it. Sure. What type of wizard? Yes. The best kind of wizard. People to the west attempt to tell you some timeshares. They're the worst. Yep. Oh, what? <laughs> so Everyone... Everyone is a person to the east who lies to themselves. Speaking of audio balance, this song is way louder. Yes. Yeah. I think they put it louder because there's a rain effect. Excuse me, a rain effect going on. Got it. Top okay. Floor. Do not go through this place just yet. Yeah, I know. I gotta explore. <laughs> gotta fight some more of these horrible things. I legit cannot tell if Celis is in the front row or not. She is not. Rogue I wouldn't more worry about it. I mean, she's not going to do much damage with that sword anyway. Just keep her in the back. Road delineation in this game is really, really bad. So, why can't Celeste use katanas to uh, use Runeblade? Uh, because she can't equip katanas. But why not? They're both swords. Hey, yeah, Gratanas take a uh, certain degree of finesse to use. Very I guess they are sword. only sharp on one do edge. They? they do. I, I mean, if you, you want to get extremely tactical, the way that you probably swing a katana is way different than uh, a sword. Yeah. I do like those people who are like, oh, I only use katanas because they are much superior swords when really. Katanas had to be folded so many times because their iron was a complete crap. Yep. Uh, so, so that guy her. said his second hand's pointing to a 30. This is yeah. part of a dumb side thing that you have to pay attention to. These are the wizards we were talking about. Yeah. 
they're dead. Not before uh, doing some damage. Mm hmm. Um, ba -ba 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 -ba. No, but like, okay, so. A normal sword. Like, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get a little technical at this for a moment. Mm hmm. A normal sword, you know, you, you can, you, you generally actually uh, can keep your hands close together. Like, you, you actually need to put weight behind it and whatever. Um, the method of swinging a katana, because they are generally lighter weight and everything, um, is keeping your hands as far apart on the hilt as possible. And when you are swinging and you're getting close to your, your striking point, you pull back with your lower hand in order to sort of snap the blade forward. Alright. Also, yes, welcome to the Goblin Gooks. Yep. Um, vanish. This is one character He's gone. Oh, okay, hold on. <laughs> yeah. He's dead. Oh, man, if only you had access to a magic AoE weapon. <laughs> yeah, this is, those guys are actually the main reason. I said, just bring Edgar. Mm -hmm. I was expecting that chest to kill me or something. Nope. The door is rusted shut. Yeah, katanas aren't shaped properly to absorb spells. That's correct. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's the other thing. We will be coming back to open up that door much later. Okay. What's so, up? So the drill. Yes. Did you just drill that person? You did. I mean, they won the fight. Okay. Me. Chat. It's time for some uh, art. Perhaps some jokes. No, I'd rather not that you're not going to put here but later when newbie's forgotten about this put your best stroke on his twitter <laughs> anyway um i just realized that the signs don't mean anything in this place correct everything in this place is lying to you well good fight so, I think the downside, like, yeah, I can runic anything from this lady, but she generally gets a turn before me. Yep. She's pretty fast, yeah. It's almost like she's a dancer, and she's very quick. A dancer who can cast fire magic. She can cast all the raw spells. See? Because she goes raw, raw. Yeah. She's more of a cheerleader, really. Mm -hmm. This is Boomba. Jesus Christ! Yeah. <laughs> yes. Voice of dog has to write. Hey, newbie, you want to see my new fire first spell? Boom. <laughs> it's okay if they don't. She doesn't kill anyone with an AOE version of that spell. You just cast cure twice, and everyone's back to normal. You can use oh. that same uh, tone of voice for the later weapon we find. Mm-hmm. Or the later tool. Oh no. This poor woman. Yeah, <laughs> she's fine. Oops, there we go. That's the one I want. You can put somebody, you can attack somebody, you can attack the other one. And we're done. I mean, you can just run from these fights. You don't have to fight everything. Don't I? Yeah, no, it might no, be. No, you uh, don't. Might be getting to the edge of my patience for random encounters. Alright, jump between buildings, got it. I don't think Newbie likes Crime Town very much because it's not him doing the crime. Mm. <laughs> Let me look at my watch here. 6, 10, 50. You didn't need to tell me. Maybe I wanted to figure it out. You could have just walked around and talked to everyone. Every single, oh, almost all the thieves in this town 
tell you a time. You have to systematically write down all the ones they tell you to tell, so it shows the ones that they didn't tell you. Mm-hmm. Oops. Put that up. Process of elimination. Yep. Or, you know, ask Crumb. Or just remember. <laughs> Fine. Your chat is saying that no one wants to see you play this. <laughs> yeah, I knew this was here. I'm aware of the train saw. What I like about it is it has two animations. That do two completely different things. Mm -hmm. Well, the short-lived era of the drill. Not really. No, <laughs> drill's better than this. It is. is it? Is it? It's not as much fun, but it's better. Yeah. The chainsaw looks amazing, and it actually does a tiny bit more damage to uh, targets than the drill does. Problem is, the chainsaw has a 50% chance. Ah, preemptive strike, huh? It's 50 or 33% chance to do its other animation, which is not so useful sometimes. That one. Hey, newbie, want to see my chainsaw and hockey mask? <laughs> Why Edgar has a hockey mask to play with his chainsaw? Because this, this, is, a, this is a game of pop culture references, don't you know? <laughs> yeah, it really is. Y'all thought it was just the American translation. If they were there all along. <laughs> Once again, we get to the thing that with everyone knows how to use guns in this thing, but your team members all use, you know, claws and boomerangs. These guys don't use guns, they threw a wrench. Yeah, but guns exist. Do they? Soldiers have them. Like, no, I like, actually do they? They have Magitek weaponry. <sighs> I fell into a trap, didn't I? Yes. There's nothing. Okay, no, I thought I was gonna get ambushed. Like, you walk into a building and it's just like, ah, there's just a potion in here. God, Zozo, you're, you're like failing on multiple levels. Yeah, okay, that owns. So, yeah, somebody mentioned in chat and I had to do it again just to confirm it. What happens there is if you steal, and you successfully steal, you steal silver spectacles. At which point, he counter steals you for the cost of silver spectacles. Oh, nice. You will always steal that 444 one gill. Or 4,444. Well, you, you know what I mean. Words. Yeah. There's nothing up over here, by the way. You know, the clock doesn't even have a minute hand? It's fucked up. <laughs> Do not mess around with the Veil Dancer. Yeah. Oh, all it is is you have to inspect a bunch of different clocks, that's it. Or, or, or do the clocks lie as well? Yes, everything in here lies. That's great. The clocks, and you don't expect just the clocks, all the thieves you're going to meet as you're wandering around also tell you the time. So you have to re remember both. Mm-hmm. I should start. I, I, it's so easy to do fights. <laughs> and then I'm like, I'll just do the fights. You have Edgar. Yeah. You win. Yep. It's not a problem. I mean, you can level up. You said there's some dude I have to go to in the north? No. You already talked to him. It was the merchant. You can go to the place that you have to climb now. Well, 
Wait, what did the merchant do? I don't even remember. He's the only guy in town who says the truth. He says this place is dangerous. Yeah, that's what we were talking about. We said, yeah, you need to go to the north to go talk to a dude and then go to a, uh, a house in there to get the thing. It's mainly to get to the house to get the chainsaw. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm seriously having a... <laughs> but what is heavier moment here of just like staring at the screen of like, what? <laughs> that's that's a good move. A strong okay. closer. By the way, he can use magnitude eight. That's a yeah. death move too. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Like old games. Terrible in every game they exist. Yeah, this <laughs> uh, this whole place is just hey, keep everyone above. 250 you know, health. If he's supposed to live in the hills, why is he in the, this town? Um, the town is surrounded by mountains. Yeah, but town's in a valley. Couldn't steal! <laughs> that owns! Yeah. I was really hoping that happened. If you had gotten to the top and, oh, and shit. hadn't incurred, I would have told you about it. What? That. Oh, that's the shell one correctly wounded, okay. Sorry, I see barrier ring and I kind of... <laughs> five has spoiled me. Yeah. You already have a reflect ring, though. Mm -hmm. Hello, many thieves. Yeah, so each of them says something different. Many strong thieves. It's two o'clock. It's already twelve. Mm-hmm. So after you talk what? to every single thief. I enjoy how it's the uh, sort of culture of a town to never give anyone the correct time. I do like the guy. How long do we have to keep doing this? It's telling the truth. Hard day's work of lying. Yeah. Man, I had to tell people the wrong time so many times today. Can't just use the same time all the time. I'll be right twice a day. I'm in line. I I I came here in the line. Don't tell me not to cut. <laughs> Followed procedure as I was instructed to. Oh my god. Yeah, but you're not wearing an eye patch. You're dead anything. to me. <laughs> Is everybody gone? Good. <laughs> Didn't want to let me go? Huge mistake. You're now somewhat dead. Alright, yeah, you're supposed to jump between the things here. But I bet you if I keep going up... Yeah! There's the good relic, I think. And what did you get? Good. There. He's complete. Indeed he is. We'll give Sabin, not Sabin, Cyan back his, uh... Hyper his... Wrist later. Yeah. You can probably have him equip that Thief's, uh, ring again. Or glove, or not glove. Dagger. Wow, too many items. No, you want to mug with the boomerang, because it makes a hilarious animation. Yeah, it really moon, does. The moon, the moon ring blade does more damage. Fair enough. Oh, jeez. I'm gonna backstab you with this boomerang. What was the OGs for? Oh, by the way, if you uh, mess around long enough, these guys start throwing things. Mm -hmm. Not a good day for Celis. No. It's not the same day that all this has happened in, has it? Is it? No. I Means you got drummed out of the army, like when you first meet her. Oh, that's the same day. Sir. Why am I? I'm on the wrong person.
All the other people are wearing hats that give them an extra 10 or 12.5% of their health, so she isn't, so she has a little bit less health than everybody else, so she dies more. I don't know, that would've killed Locke too, actually. Eh, Locke's a thief, he's fine. He'd catch it. If only. Oh boy, okay. Hop. And you can give her, like, a ring or something that gives her more defense as well. Uh, I don't think defense matters against mithril daggers being thrown at your face. No parkour, parkour. Sweet parkour action. Extreme nope. Yeah, I'm enjoying a lot of the new Record Keeper content for the most part. Oh, we are extremely dead. Wait, are you? Yes. Maybe. I'll, I'll take it. Yeah, he's a treasure hunter. He just hunts for treasure in other people's pants. Phrasing. Poor Locke. All by his lonesome. Locke almost died. Ah, good. My diligence has paid off. Oh, and getting items and such? Oh, hey, this fight that I'm gonna run from. Mm hmm. Ah, damn it, Zealous. Again? Close. Enough that I have to cast Cure. No, Celeste is not wearing any pants because she was at the beach when she was drummed out of the army. Yes, when she said, you know what, forget this. Yeah. So, she went to the beach wearing her cape with shoulder pads. Oh, you need to wear some armor. Well, yeah, protect yourself from the sun. Mm -hmm. Also, the other guys are wearing things like ninja gear and, and throw vests, and she's wearing a dress. Mm-hmm. Damn it! I don't believe it's possible to get off Runic before she does anything. <laughs> oh well. Whole thing about yeah, Runic being... are, The main reason I told you to bring along Celeste not simply to Runic is just to cast Cure afterwards to save yourself on resources. I mean, I was going to bring her anyway. Yeah. yeah. She's I, too useful. Damn it. <laughs> I can almost tell exactly when a newbie gets into a rough fight. <laughs> the encounter rate in this dungeon is, like, off the charts. It's really high. Mm hmm It's a town full of ne'er-do-wells. It's the town of misfits. Oh shit! What's up? The good stuff. Mhm. Mm Did you get the, the uh, thing I told you? Why not to pick up a weapon? Oh, oh wow. New bullets. Yeah, that one might be a bit harder to pull off. I'll give it a go though. Forward to down to back. All enemies in spiritual flame. Yes, it's super good. It's an AOE. Yes, finally. The brothers. In the space of 10 seconds... Yeah, I'd like to point out, that weapon was 57 points stronger than the one you just had. <laughs> okay. 57 points. Yeah, that's a move. <laughs> I love this stupid animation. You don't need to worry about random encounters anymore. You've got Saban and Enter. I have the brothers. Yeah. yeah. The two of them together do about 550 to 600 damage to everything on the screen per turn. They're faster than the others. You'll be hooked on the brothers. Mm hmm Oh, boy. 
are you doing? What? Dance party. All right. I can't remember this guy's name, but I remember the fight. Dadaluma. And this amazing sprite. Man looks like he just got punched in the face real good. <laughs> like, I know it's supposed to be he's doing a jump kick here, but like it looks like he just got clocked in the face real good and is flying backwards. I just assumed he was like in the crane stance while doing uh, Russian dancing. Alright. What do you got People to from the chat are asking you to steal this guy's stuff. Jeweled rank, got it. She only has poison enough to have normal poison. <laughs> Celeste's job for this fight is to keep everyone else alive. That drill went to an unfortunate place. It really did. <laughs> the... <laughs> Pretty much everything in this fight is going to a very unfortunate place. Yeah. Oh, you just hit me for a ton of damage? Hold on a second. Let me take care of that. <laughs> Hold my beer. What's a button? There we go. It's slide. Oh, okay. apparent. What's up? Nope. Go ahead. Yeah, this guy has two possible steals, is the thing. Hmm. But you already took one, so. Womp womp. <laughs> Yeah, I remember right from Record Keeper, this dude's condition is... Hmm. Whoop. Time for the move. Oh, what the? I did the blitz input wrong. Oh. As it turns out, you made the, the input a little bit more complex. It's harder to do. Yep. Neither of those guys are Danny Rand. There we go. Good old Rising Phoenix. Now, if you pause it during the middle of the, uh, animation for Rising Phoenix, you'll notice that they're just Bull a sevens. bunch of yeah. sevens on fire, yeah. Yeah. That wasn't too bad. Yeah, you have too much damage for this guy to be a problem. Mm-hmm. I think Even if you, if you are slightly with... underleveled. Yeah. If you come here with Seven, Edgar, Gaw, and Sign, I think you can kill them in like two rounds. Just because they can just pump out so much damage. So hey, you got a was... twist headband. Good for you. That relic prevents petrification. I'll take it. Seven, you want a new hat? Yeah, oh. you do. Yeah, Fun you do. fact, Celis can imp that guy. Nice. I should have tried that. <laughs> I was, I like, I legit thought it. Like, I went over imp and I'm like, yeah, there's fucking no way he's vulnerable to imp. <laughs> Alright. It's time. Before you yeah. go straight to the north, go to the left and right. My weird crystal daughter. Well. Alright, time to figure out which relic is coming off for the sandals. I think, oh wait. <laughs> Zavin still has a star pendant on. <laughs> That's an easy fix. Hmm. I wonder what relic is coming <laughs> off. <laughs> I don't even remember what the other thing I picked up was. Nothing important. We should go down to the end of the list to see if there was anything new. Uh, doesn't look that way. Oh, it was an explosion. Nice. Yeah. That'll be useful down the line. Yeah, I All think right. explosions heal like 1500 health. It's nice. Er here we come to uh, someone that Crow and I pronounce differently. Kramu? 
Oh, geez. I forgot they gave her a sprite. They gave her a portrait. It's a hilarious. Portrait it's not great. Now, how is it actually supposed to be? It's Ramu. Oh, I, yeah, I, I call it Ramu. Yeah. yeah. It, when specifically, I was growing up, it was always Rama. Yeah, but they, say, they say his name in 14. It is, it is yeah. Ramu. Yeah, that's fine. It's just one of those things, like, if you never hear the correct one, you just get set in your head that it's a certain way. Like, for example, Kama. What's the girl in your party's name? Who, Selys? Yeah, I thought she was, like, a Greek philosopher. Mm -hmm. Like Socrates, but no. That um, Celeste, not Celes. That that noise is questionable. That they just made as she zipped around the room. <laughs> She's growling. The sound of a growl. <laughs> <laughs> Oh yeah? If you just bring Gao by himself, what does he say to Ramu? He talks in Gao speech. Go. Oh. <laughs> I like that you have to bring Gao by himself for him to be the one that talks yes. to Ramu. <laughs> Anyone else will take over otherwise. <laughs> I'm Ramu, the Lord of Crime. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I like how you decide to have your uh, sort of a hideout in this town. Think of it this way. Would you ever look for an esper in a town like this? No. Would you ever climb to the highest floor of this building? Where you can't actually do that and you have to jump between other buildings? No. Scenes. Good time to uh, take a drink. Mm -hmm. <laughs> that guy was just his bodyguard. He was like actually just hired to keep people from getting to Ramu. Yeah. I've been drinking Royal Jamaican alcoholic ginger beer. <laughs> Was that me cracking my knuckles? Yes, I have a bad habit of cracking my knuckles, and I've learned recently that my mic actually picks that up. Sorry. <laughs> oh, are we saying what we're drinking? I'm drinking very old Barton. It's delicious. I'm just drinking sparkling water. Here, I'll crack my thumbs. If you didn't, your mic didn't pick it up. It was very quiet. I'll crack my neck. <laughs> Good try. Here, I'm gonna crack my elbow. Here we go. <laughs> I know they're like picking her up and putting her in the bed, but I like to think that the two of them were just grabbing Tara by the hair and pulling her along the ground and just kind of hucking her into the bed. <laughs> I mean, her hair is just solid crystal now, so. Is she made of crystal? That was always, like, my interpretation, is that she's just, like, a weird energy being right now. No, Yeah, she's... I thought she was made of, like, some ethereal quality or, like, cotton candy or something. She's covered in fur at this point. Oh, that's right. Yeah. Yeah. Fur? That's... Yeah, that's she how they did it. She pretty much turned into a werewolf. <laughs> yeah, yeah. In Dissidia, that's how they interpret it. Because that is her, uh, her EX burst form is her as an Esper. Yeah, there's a really bad hurricane down in South... I wanted to say South America. That's wrong. South United States. Like Texas-ish. Yeah. Yep, Hopefully stay safe everyone there, even though we're 
put Diddy in this video by saying it. Whatever. Who cares? <laughs> yep. The date is um, April 27th. Yep, exactly. So, Newby, what are you doing for Labor Day next weekend? <laughs> I don't know. Taking the day off. Nah, there's probably going to be a party or something. Um, yeah, fun fact about that. it's a, they're, they're apparently getting... 36 inches of rain. Mm -hmm. What? And someone, like, they had done the math and they're like, yeah, if this was a blizzard instead, it would have been 34 feet of snow. Yeah. Also known as, it's really bad. Magicite. What the? T titled, titled the video. <laughs> Magicite always confuses the shit out of me based on the sprite. <laughs> Like, what are they... Like, is it in a metal case? Are the gems green and they got this weird fucking red thing? And What the fuck is Magicite? Yeah, it, I always it's thought it was like a soul in a jar. Yeah, I always thought it was like a green crystal that on the inside there's like a pulsing red orb. Maybe? By the way, this dude just totally killed himself. Yep. Hey, he was dying anyway. He was like, I'll give you y'all my power. I'm going to die anyway. He wasn't dying. He said, I will give you my power so that my friends can get away. There's a very good ambient track track going on right now. Where, like, you can still hear the rain and there are, like, mm -hmm. little droplet sound effects. All right. Magicite. You can power gain this game to holy heck with these things. We're not going to bother with it. No. That's boring. Unless you guys really want to see it, at which point, no. So, this is where I get to uh, reveal the gimmick. Oh boy, what's the gimmick? Oh, Crimble Shins, no. He's unkillable. So, my gimmick is I want to try and teach people Magicite magic to make them more similar to their Record Keeper incarnations. Now, okay. what this means, like, like let, let, let me give the, 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 the summary here. Uh, the exceptions to this are uh, Celis and Terra. I will give them Magicite that is more based around their natural skills. Like, Celis gets ice magic because she already starts out with ice magic. I will have to um, figure out who gets lightning because I don't think anybody naturally gets lightning in Record Keeper. But I'll figure that out on my own time. Uh, Sabin would get fire based skills, though he's not a good spellcaster, so whatever. Um, Locke and Edgar would actually get status effects because that's what they do in Record Keeper. The entire idea of this is to try and actually keep people a little independent still. All right. Let's tailor make these people after a video game that was made after this game. Yes. This is a dumb plan. This is really dumb. But I want to see how this turns out. So for now, I'm going to give Celis Karen. She becomes better at healing. And, okay, I should also say, if somebody gets something 
as a side effect of having something, that's that's fine. So like, I'll probably slap Kieran on uh, lock, and as a result, he will learn fire. So whatever that happens, yeah. Which actually, that's fine because he gets fire in Record Keeper. So yeah, that works. Mm -hmm. No, uh, if you were going to be doing a four job fiesta type thing about this uh, of this game, you could make uh, espers tied to only certain characters as the limitation. Yep. Seven That's for now. what uh, hard mode uh, did of this game, which I actually thought was a neat idea. It yeah. made each character very individual. Th th this idea was kind of based on hard mode. Okay, cool. So yeah, that's it for now. Seven doesn't get an Esper because it doesn't really fit any of his skill sets. But like, <laughs> so another equivalent of this is like, all right, Edgar gets knight ability. Well, there's no knight magic. Well, we can give Ed Edgar buffs. You can give him golem when you get it eventually. Yeah, mm -hmm. like things like that. Like, we base the Espers around record keeper gimmicks to keep people a little individual. Okay, yeah. Brave New World was indeed a thing. You are correct. Oh, hi. Others. <laughs> yep, we just made it here. I, I guess. Okay, goodbye. Yahoo. Talk this on the is way one back. of those, oh shoot, we just made a major change to everything you're going to do about stuff? Hold on a sec, maybe we should have our party get back together so you can change things around if you want to. <laughs> Gal doesn't get espers, he doesn't need them. Well, you can. In Brave New World, Gal could only use two espers. Really? Which ones? Yep. Kate Sith and Fenrir. Which okay, would so give him status effects and that's it. What what is Kate Sith's real name or technically it's supposed to be pronounced Cat She, but no one pronounces it that way. Scribble Shins. <laughs> I mean you walked into that one. Fair enough. Uh back in FF six I think Kate Sith's name was just Stray. I mean oh, okay. I, the other thing is we could just it, you know record keeper thing is good but th that's going to fall apart eventually how about mm -hmm. this uh, Crumb before next session because I think we're going to be ending this pretty soon Yes. Uh, look up the list of Brave New World Esper people I will give it to you Things, and then I, I will actually just use the Brave New World thing that, there we go that works that was, uh, that's actually what I was going to suggest off screen now, if I were in charge of this, I would say, look at your espers, make a list, randomize the list, give the random one to uh, whoever it is. Doesn't matter if they like already that. have it. Uh, Brave New, yeah, Brave New World, as explained in chat, is a ROM hack of six that um, fixes some things and causes other problems. Yes. I think we're going to keep the same team for now. Yes, 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 yes. You you want to you keep the same team. Definitely for now. want to bring Seven here. Yeah, Seven uh, and 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 Edgar because I, I'm again, a, I'm a fan of the brothers. Stealing is required, and we only have one mage for now. Well, you have to bring Celis and uh, um, Locke. And Locke, yeah. They can't leave the party. Hold up! Hold the fucking phone. What's up, Sion? How did you end up with more MP than Celis? He's older. He's a level higher. Seven, than how'd her. you how'd you Okay, that's fair. Everyone's HP and MP bases are within ten or fifteen to each other in HP and like three to five in MP. Hers yep. is higher than everyone else's at the same level except for Terra and Small Child. And I think maybe Gal. Gal's actually like one of the best mages. Nice. Now uh, I do want to throw this out before we end this video. Um, I will not be using like this team for the whole game. I'm, I actually plan to be rotating people in and out as much as possible. Mm -hmm. Yeah. 
um, because I think everybody kind of has their own strengths and weaknesses. Like we've we've seen that Gal can be a powerhouse. I I showed that Cyan can be pretty all right. <laughs> sure. He has problems, but he is not unusual. Oh yeah, every character in this game has uh, strengths and weaknesses. Some just have strengths that completely overshadow their weaknesses. What was that wink? Were you winking at me? Ghost. Yes. Ghost, you survived. Wink. My friend. Now you're a yeah. tutorial. Live on, ghost. Yeah. Forever. Bye-bye. Looks like you found some really creepy items in that uh, tower over there. Let me tell you how it works. <laughs> <laughs> Looks All like right. you carry around the carcasses of dead magical beasts. Well, for uh, now. How'd you pull that one off? <laughs> for now. We're done. Next time. Magic. Magic. Yeah.